Welcome back to another episode. Today I want to introduce you to a plugin that makes it easy for your website visitors to share your articles with their social networks. Now this feature is very important to have because obviously you want your articles to be seen by as many people as possible. That's why in our premium WordPress theme called EvoPro, we have this feature baked into the theme itself where people can share your article with people on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Google Plus, and Pinterest. But if you're not using our theme and you want to have this feature, then what we what I recommend is you go to the dashboard, you go to plugins, add new, and then in the search plugins field, you type out floating social bar. And then you're going to be presented with this option. It's a very popular uh, plugin to use. I already have it active on this WordPress installation, but you could view more details here and you can read more about it. Once you install it and activate it, you'll find it in your settings section and floating social bar. And then you're presented with this page where you can choose which icons you want to show on your website, blog posts or articles. And you can reconfigure the order of the particular icons to suit your needs. And then you also have the social bar label you can type out whatever you want here, share this article, share this post, and then underneath you have the show bar on single post, pages, media, and you could also, if you have custom post types, they would show up here as well. You have to put in your Twitter username without the symbol, and then if you want it to not float, because it does float by default, you will check this um, box over here, and it won't float, um, but typically you would want it to float. And then if you don't want it to show the amount of times your article has been shared, you would check this option and it won't show the amount of times it's been shared. You would save your settings and then you would go to your one of your recent blog posts. And then you're going to see the option enabled here in this section. I'm going to turn off my admin bar. And then when you start floating down, you see that the social share icons will be floating with your page nicely and if a person clicks on one of the links a pop-up will appear they would have to be logged in typically uh, this is something that's typical with all social share plugins once they log in they'll be able to share your article or they can tweet it out use google plus uh, pin it share it on linkedin etc so it's a nice plugin to use that gives you a very easy way for people to share your articles socially with their networks this is important because viewership of your articles is important for your um, for your website, obviously, and also for your search engine rank rankings because the more times your articles get shared on social media, viewed, and your website gets visited, the better the chance for your website and articles to rank well within the search engines. So this is a nice plugin to use that makes it very easy to enable that type of floating social bar option on your website. It's a free solution. You don't have to sign up for any third-party services and you can find it on the wordpress.org uh, website and it's called Floating Social Bar. I'll leave a link in the description section below so you can take a look at that plugin and if you liked this article give us a thumbs up. If you have any comments leave them down below and of course don't forget to subscribe. Hope you found this episode helpful and I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Thank you very much. Take care.